Hey everyone, my name is Maggie. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing something different with my hair, so you can let me know if you like it. I'm also not wearing my glasses because there's a lot of glare. <laughs> Today it's very sunny, so you get to see my eyes. How amazing. So it is definitely winter now. We had our first snow. It's like 15 degrees outside uh, where I live, so uh, I just thought I'd put together kind of a, my go-to essentials for winter fashion for you guys in case it helped you out. My first winter fashion fave is uh, leggings, <laughs> honestly. I um, have been wearing a lot of leggings and like long shirts or leggings over skirts and dresses. I'm just like not about pants that much anymore. So I've been wearing these black leggings from Walmart. They are like six bucks. They are not cotton. I don't know what they're made out of. They're like stretchy and oh they're mostly nylon there you go these are great though they're just black leggings they're long they're stretchy these are in a 2x um but i think they go up bigger than this um yeah so leggings oh yeah these are also faded glory the brand gotta love walmart for some things you know obviously in the winter if it's cold where you live you need a coat or a jacket or both <laughs> uh and i love jackets and shoes those are like the two things I can't stop buying are jackets and shoes. So I have jackets here that I wanted to show you. This jacket is from last year, but this is still in style. You can probably get this at Old Navy at, I don't know, Forever 21, whatever you want. But it is a denim jacket with this, I guess, I think this is called Sherpa inside. It's not inside the arms, um, but it is inside like the body. And I like that it's not inside the arms because it gives me more room for my arms, <laughs> which are large other coat that i have actually got this year amazing it is this amazing jacket from target ava and viv it's hard to see i can insert a picture of me wearing it but it is this i don't know what you would call this pattern i'll, I'll look it up i'll put the link in below but this very interesting flashy pattern which i don't usually wear but i just like fell in love with this jacket mostly because of this giant hood this hood is giant and it's great for cuddling up. It's like kind of like a built-in scarf um, and I'm just like obsessed with it and I really love it. Layering is what I do in the winter. I am the layer queen and my favorite way to layer, uh, there's two pieces to it and this is really cool because it isn't femme <laughs> most of the time. Um, super femme so that's kind of why I like it because I feel like in the winter I feel a lot more masculine presenting. My favorite way to layer is a graphic t-shirt and a button-up shirt. That's my favorite way to layer. My favorite graphic tees is this shirt which you might have seen before um, from Mary Lambert's March because I love Mary Lambert. I have her words tattooed on my body. Obviously I love her. Um, but it says Mary Lambert makes me emotional which is definitely true and this is in I think an XL yeah from her merch store and it is like really soft some people or bands will sell t-shirts that are not soft but this shirt is genuinely soft one of my favorite t-shirts to wear seriously it really is this shirt I would usually wear it with I would say like flannel that has black in it somewhere and my favorite flannel to wear is this giant black and red one and this I thrifted um, in like I'd say like I don't know July or August it's like a 2x in men's and it's just long and I roll the sleeves up and it like covers my butt and I like to wear this almost as a jacket on not such cold days uh, but it's just big and comfy it makes me feel kind of like a fringy uh, and cool so love that please guys thrift because you can find tons of things if you thrift seriously my last winter essential fashion piece is boots obviously everyone loves boots me personally i'm not a fan of high boots i'm not a fan of boots that go up my calf uh, I, that, that to me feels terrifyingly restrictive and i don't want to stuff my legs into a leather prison <laughs> so i really prefer ankle boots and i have a couple here that i have been loving um the first one i actually got recently so i haven't gotten to wear them that often but it's these boots they're from yours clothing which is in um england an English company that makes plus size clothing and they make shoes in triple E which is my shoe size so I got these boots like earlier in December they took a long time to get here but they are very cute this is kind of a uh, suede material Wow I just noticed that these strings are coming off maybe don't purchase your shoes from there Wow 
Anyway, I like how these look. <laughs> uh, we'll come back on the quality, but these are cute and I don't have any black boots that are comfortable, so these will fit my feet, which is amazing because nothing fits my feet. Um, so those are great. And then this shoe I think is my shoe of the season. I got these at Payless. I don't even know if they're a wide. Yeah, these aren't even a wide, but they're these like brown hiking boots and they're low. Um, they're brown and black. And I think I've stretched them out definitely since I've worn them because when I first wore them, I wore them for four days in a row when I was on my feet a lot and my toes went numb and I think I got a bunion. So I was like not so keen about these, but I feel like I've definitely stretched them out now and they're so comfortable. Well, it can like put a little bit of masculinity into a femme outfit or just really like butch up already masculine outfit. And I just love them so much and I'm gonna wear them today. And I think this is my favorite shoe of the season, you guys. Favorite shoe up season. It's really gay too. I love it. Okay guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope maybe I helped you with some inspiration on how to style yourself this winter. It's very hard because you're covering up yourself most of the time and there's lots of going inside a shop where it's hot and then coming outside where it's cold. All very confusing and terrible. Anyway, good luck with that. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment below on what you think of it and I will see you next time. Bye!